celebrate Jesus right now, wherever you are watching us from. Celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus, celebrate Jesus. Somebody is worthy to be praised. I want to see your digital hands being clapped right now. I'm not seeing them, I'm not seeing them. Clap your hands wherever you are. Shout Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for coming tonight again as we are having another special online prayer first. I kid you not, your life will never be the same and you will experience the difference. Amen. First and foremost, I would like to greet my father, the senior apostle, Apostle Dr. Bright Modau, and my mother, Pastor Constance Modau. Can we celebrate them in the name of Jesus wherever you are? It is indeed an honor to come your way again and it is indeed an honor. Can you please just flow in strings? It is indeed an honor to come your way. And I like to believe that there is something that God has packed for you. So wherever you are joining us from, share this broadcast. Invite, invite to tell them that youth in action is here. The Timothy company has arrived. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So I just want us right now just to take a moment of prayer to to say, oh God, in this moment we have gathered. Father, take charge. Take charge. Take charge. So wherever you are, just begin to pray to say, oh God, take charge. Father, we come before your presence right now. We have gathered as your youth, oh God, to say, our Father, our Heavenly Father, take charge. Take over. Take charge. Take over. Take charge. Take over. Take charge. Take over. Take charge. What is it that you are going through? But believe you me, the power and the God of this house is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that which we can think or imagine. He's able. We saturate this platform right now to say, oh God, let your fire go through and consume. Let your fire go through and consume. Let your fire go through and consume. some of you are going to receive today just a scent, a scent, a simple touch is going to transform, is going to change, is going to rejuvenate. You are going to experience the difference. Wherever you are joining us from, you are, might be joining us on our teams, you might be joining us on our YouTube. Listen to me. The same God that operates in this house, the God of my Father, Apostle Dr. Bright and my mother, Pastor Constance Mudao, will touch you wherever you are. Believe you me. Can we celebrate Jesus for that? 
that a scent of water is about to touch you. Clap your digital hands right there. Clap your digital hands right there. Oh, I, I feel your hands. I see them. Increase them. Increase them. Somebody shout amen. I see you. I see you. Shout that amen. Hallelujah. So thank you for joining us again. You must understand that in this house we are privileged with sons and daughters. And we never run out of stock. That's one thing about this house. We never run out of stock. When you think you stocked the shelf, listen, there's a storehouse that we go to. We pull them out. And believe you me, something shall happen. So I want us today to receive a son of our father. He's a commissioner. Oh my God. I, I, I want to say a lot, but I don't want to say a lot. But you will hear him for, for, for yourself. I'm telling you, the fire, the prayer fire, you are going to feel it, believe you me. So with a standing innovation, or rather a digital standing innovation, I want us to receive a son of my father, a commissioner. I want us to receive commissioner, Musa Jones. Can we celebrate him? Can we celebrate? I'm not seeing you. I, I'm not seeing you. Celebrate. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Uh, yes, you, you, you. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Jones, Mukabela. We are here to pray. I'm here to lead you in prayer. I want to talk less and pray more. Hallelujah. Wherever you are, I want you to take just two minutes and close your eyes. Look at your life. As your eyes are closed, look at your lives, look at your life of your family, look at the life of your relatives, but most importantly, just look at your life, where you are currently, are you satisfied of where you are, look at where you are currently, and look at where you want to be. I want you to focus on that destination. Your current state will be history after tonight. I assure you with that we have prayed for this service. And finally we are here. Thank you for this moment. Mighty God, you are worthy to be praised. There's none like you, Lord. We give you all the glory. We exalt you, Lord. We adore you, my Father. We love you, Lord, for who you are. In spite of our tribulations, in spite of our troubles, we still see that Jesus is Lord. No matter what we are going through, we still believe, Lord, that as long as we are still breathing, There is change that will take place. Our lives shall never be like this. When you created humanity, your purpose was for humanity to take charge, was for humanity to take lead, was for humanity to take dominion. And I know, my God, that you are on your throne and you can see what is happening. And you waited, oh Lord, for this opportunity. Because I believe and I know 
that you are a God who shows off. You are the God who waits for an opportunity. You are the God who wants to be seen. Whenever we are lacking, you want to be seen. You want to be recognized as Jehovah Jireh. Whenever people are sick, you want to be recognized as Jehovah Rapha. Whenever we are astray, you want to be recognized as Jehovah Ra, you are as the shepherd. Oh Lord, may you be with us, almighty God. El Shaddai, show off your power. Show off your power to your children tonight. My Father, my God, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. I want us to open our Bibles. In the book of Philippians chapter 2, verse number 15. We welcome you, we welcome you as you join wherever you are. For distance is not a barrier. Wherever you have joined on our social platforms, we give glory to God and we thank you for partaking. Your life will never be the same again. Philippians chapter 2 verse 15. Let me read it from verse 14. Do all things without complaining and disputing, that you may become blameless and harmless. Children of God without fault, in the midst of a crooked and a perverse generation, among whom you shine as the light in the world. Mark chapter 11. us to spend much time in prayer. Mark chapter 11, verse 23. For assuredly, I say to you, whoever says to this mountain, be removed and be cast into the sea and does not doubt in his heart but believes that those things he will he says will be done he will have whatever he says number 24 therefore I say to you whatever things you ask when you pray believe that you receive them and you will have them 25 and what and whenever you stand pray if you have anything against anyone forgive him that your father in heaven may also forgive you your trespasses but if you do not forgive neither will your father in heaven forgive your trespasses where we have read from the book of Philippians, the scripture says, the Apostle Paul mentioned something that is very important. He mentioned that you must find yourself blameless. I just want to take that word blameless. What do we mean by that? You know, some of the breakthroughs, some of the successes, and some of the things that we could have overcame. We are still struggling even today. The issue being that we have the things which the devil is using against us that blocks or hinders God from blessing us. What do I mean for, by that? Let me talk more especially about forgiveness. Many people we have grudges against one another. Yes, we are not perfect. Every one of us is not perfect. But all I can say to you, in the book of Mark chapter 11, the word of God states that 
Whenever we stand in prayer, we need to forgive one another. What I like in the word of God or in the things of God, on the kingdom of God is that there is order when it comes to the doings, to, the, to our actions as Christians. We need to forgive one another. Yes, we can tell the mountain that you mountain, from where you are, can you move and go and cast yourself into the sea? Yes, it is possible because we have the authority in us. But there is a condition. Even though you can have the courage, you can have that zeal, you can have the authority burning inside of you, boldly declaring that whatever I say, it must come to pass. But there is the condition. The condition is you need to forgive. I want us to go and pray and say, Oh Lord, I forgive all my enemies. I want to find myself blameless. I want to move forward. I want to receive something special from you. I am tired of being hindered from receiving my blessings. Let us go and pray and say, I know it is tough, but I want you to do it for yourself. You are doing yourself a favor. Release them from your heart before we engage into this prayer and declarations. I need you to release them, release all the grudges, and also ask God to forgive you when you are done with releasing them. And surely the word states that it is biblically referenced that God will also forgive you. Let us begin to pray. La bracatos ketaliaman todios sibriacata zibrandolios cota bria celibaya. Lord, we come before you tonight. We know, O oh Lord, we are not perfect. We know, O oh Lord, there are people who have wronged us. There are people, Father God, who have hurt us. There are people who hurt us yesterday. There are people who have hurt us today. And there are people who might also hurt us, Father God, even after this service. But, oh Lord, as you've forgiven us, we pray in the name of Jesus. May we release them. May we release all the grudges. We release all the hatred from us. We release them even though it is tough. We release them, Father Lord, even though we have ego. We release them even though we have pride. Oh Lord, may you welcome our prayers. Hear us as we pray tonight. May you answer in the name of Jesus. May you find us blameless tonight. Oh Lord, I pray. Libra Kotos Katalimaya. Libra Kita Brias Kal Yamente. Rabranda Yokos Kital Yoko. Rish Capricon Tilia Toskele. Ribranda Yos Katalio. Libra Katus Kaliamante. Rimamanda Yos Kabatushke. Ribra Kotus Kataliaba. Ribranda Yos Kutabria. Mandalios Katariama. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Shout hallelujah, hallelujah, wherever you are. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Glory to God. Yes, Jesus. We are moving. You, I can feel it. What is it that you are feeling? I can feel that somebody is feeling lighter now because of you have released people from your shoulders. In the same scripture in the book of Mark, chapter 11 verse 23 it says for as surely I say to you whoever says to this mountain be removed and be cast into the sea and does not doubt in his heart mark this words does not doubt in his heart but believes that those things he says will be done he will have whatever he says Ladies and gentlemen, as you have heard, as long as you believe, as long as you believe that this mountain shall be removed, most assuredly it shall be cast out and it shall go into the sea. 
there's something that I like on this verse. It says, be removed and be cast into the sea. I don't know what is the mountain that you are facing. I don't know which mountain is it that is standing before you that is hindering you to go to the other side. We have different types of problems, but you yourself, you know your mountain. But allow me to say to you tonight that as of tonight, let us change the mindset. Let us be careful of what we say. The Bible says, for death and life lies within the power of the tongue. Whatever we say, whatever we say, it might be death. Whatever we say, it might be life. When you talk too much about the mountain, it's like now you are worshipping the situation. You are telling us how big the mountain is. But from tonight, I want you to talk to the mountain. Rather than talking about the mountain. We make mistakes most of the times. And we don't know who our enemies are. We don't know who is within our circle. Sometimes the people whom we share our problems with. Those are the people who persecute us. Those are the people whom we are not even aware that they are pretending to be friends. But honestly speaking, they do not like us. Instead, they hate us more than the devil himself. I want you to talk to your mountain. We are going to pray you know your mountain. Wherever you are, take this moment. And take my words seriously. I want you to talk to that mountain. That mountain might be unemployment. That mountain might be lack. That mountain might be limitation. That mountain might be bankruptcy. That mountain can be hatred or anger. That mountain can be a setback. That mountain can be rejection. I want you to pray. Look at that mountain and tell this mountain, yes. you, mountain you mountain, you have no power. You have no power. You have no power in my life. You have no power in my Be life. Be ye cast out. Be cast out. Be cast out. Be cast out. Out of my way. Out of my way. Out of my way. Out of my Begin way. Begin to pray. La prakatos ketali manto. Rapatos kitali mantalia. Zipra kotos kaliamantaliba. Rapapapatos kotani manto. I stand on the gap in the name of Jesus. I stand on behalf of my friends. I stand on behalf of my family. I stand on behalf of my workplace. I stand on behalf of anyone who is close to my heart, who is within my heart. And I declare and I decree as I stand at the servant of God, I declare you mountain, be removed in the name of Jesus. You mountain of sickness, be removed. You mountain of unemployment, be removed. You mountain of joblessness, be removed. You mountain of curses, be removed. You mountain of limitations, be removed. Remove that mountain. Destroy that mountain. I 
declare they declare the mountain you are facing the mountains you are facing they shall be flat just like it happened to Zerubbabel all your problems they shall shrink all your problems shall shrink all your problems shall dissolve In my finances, be removed. <laughs> I can feel the fire in the platforms. I can feel the fire. The devil is a liar. The devil is a loser. We are the generation of Timothy. Yes, Lord. Be removed. John chapter 15, verse number 7. If you abide in me uh -huh. and my words abide in you, yes. you will ask what you desire yes. and it shall be done for you. Amen. If you abide in me uh -huh. and my words abide in you, yes. you will ask what you desire and it shall be done for you. Whatever you desire, in the name of Jesus, yes. you just need to abide, abide by the Lord, abide by him. I need you to abide. abide. I need you to abide. I abide. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my God. My father, my God. I declare. I declare. And I decree. And I decree. As of tonight. As of tonight. I reconnect. I reconnect. Myself. Myself. To you. To you. I reconcile. I reconcile. My spirit. My spirit. To your spirit, to your spirit. Oh Lord, oh Lord, I declare, I declare, and I decree, and I decree, I shall abide, I shall abide in you, in you, and you shall abide, you shall abide in me. Begin to pray. Yes, Lord. 
In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. We pray according to the word. Abide. Oh, we shall abide in him. Yes, Lord. The mistakes we have done. The mistakes we have done. Shall be history from tonight. Amen. Amen. What unpleased God yesterday. Yes. I'm telling you, we are the new creatures. Uh-huh. We are the new human beings. Yes, yes, yes. Mark chapter 11, Matthew chapter 11, verse 29. <clears throat> Take my yoke upon you. from me for I am gentle and lowly in heart and you will find rest for your souls my God my God for I am gentle and lowly in heart and you will find rest in your souls for my yoke is easy yes and my burden is light for my yoke is easy and my burden is light the depression you are struggling of take it and lay it on him this was Jesus who is talking he was talking here He shall give you rest as of tonight. You shall have peace as of tonight. You shall be happy as of tonight. The old is no more. Amen. The old is gone. God is about to change someone's story. Wherever you are, where you are connected. Yes. I can tell you there is God there. There is God on that platform. There is God in heaven. He waited for this opportunity. He is the God of showing off. Yeah, 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 Baba. Oh Lord. Yes, yes, yes. Show off your glory. Ah, yeah, yeah. Show off, show off. I want you to pray and say, God. My strengths, yes, yes, my sorrow, yes, Lord, my tears, yes, the rejections, hey. the persecutions. Ay, ay, ay. You can name every yoke la, 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 la. that is upon you. Release to him, release to him. Ribata Shimlia Contebrios Lord, we pray, oh Lord, we pray, we pray, we pray. Oh Lord, we offer the supplications unto you. Oh Lord, we make these petitions unto you. Oh Lord, we pray unto thee. Oh Lord, may you take these heavy yokes, the yokes of disappointment, the yokes of anxiety, the yokes of Depression. Oh Lord, take these yokes. Take these yokes, my God. Take these yokes, my God. Take these yokes, oh Lord. Release, oh God. We are tired, oh Lord. 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 We rest all to you. Yes, Lord. Bakatosh Kataliya Baya Rapa Baba Bandarios Kataliya Baya Riska Pretos Kotopetaliosa We are tired, O oh Lord O oh Lord, we are tired We have tried, we could not do it We have tried with our own wisdom Yes, yes, yes But O oh Lord, we are still struggling Yes, Lord We are tired, O oh Lord Baba, 
I don't know for how long have you been in this battle. But all I know, victory is guaranteed in the Lord Jesus. Your battle might be too long. You might be saying now in your heart that you don't know, you don't know my battles. You don't know the mountains I climb. You don't know the struggles, the persecutions I face. Yes, you are right, I do not know. But that battle, may I assure you tonight, it might be too long. Yes, 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 yes. It is guaranteed. He said, You will never, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Hey. Where I'm going, I shall not come with you. Yes. But I will leave you with the helper. Yes, yes. I will leave you with the advocate. I will leave you with the Holy Spirit. He shall also remind you of the things, my words that I've said to you. Aye, aye, aye. Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes. Yes, Lord, we continue to pray. I will read this quickly and give you a summary from there. We are shooting straight. Yes, yes. We are going to a marathon oh now. My God, oh my we God. are fully charged. We are ready. 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 We have entered in the holy of holies. New dimension. Where healing is something else. Yes, yes, yes. Where stagnation is a subject. Montos Kolabaya. Shakrabakato. Yes, Lord. John 11. Verse number 38. Then Jesus again groaning in himself came to the tomb. It was a cave and a stone lay against it. Jesus said, take away the stone. And 
underline this. Take away the stone. The stone that kept Jesus Christ inside the grave, the tomb. It was placed by a human being. It was placed by someone. Let me go into the spiritual things. When the enemies or the witches and wizards, when they want to close you, they make sure that they destroy, they demolish what you have and they make sure that whatever that belongs to you, it is buried. They also make sure that they put that stone to make sure that you will never come out from that grave. They want to see you being detained in suffering, in crying, in weeping the rest of your life. The enemy does not wish anything good for you. But allow me to say to you tonight, yes, Lord. Jesus is saying, take away the stone. Take away the stone. When they called him, they knew that he will do something. Lazarus can come back to life. But when he appeared, where Lazarus was laying, he said, remove, take away the stone. Take away the stone. We are going to instruct everyone who has put a stone in your life. Yes. Anyone who has engraved you, anyone who has buried your fortune, we command them in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Take away the stone. Take away the stone. Remove the stone. Yes, yes. In the name of Jesus. Remove it. Say this after me. Oh no. Oh no. My father, my father. My father, my father. I stand on the death. I stand under the influence of the Holy Ghost. Under the influence of the Holy Ghost. I declare and I decree. I declare and I decree. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every stone. Every stone. That has detained me. That has detained that me. That has detained my fortune. That has detained that my That has fortune. detained my blessings. That has detained In my the blessings. name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Be ye removed. Be ye removed. Be ye removed. Be ye removed. In the name of of the in Father, the name of the Son, in the name of the Son, in the name of the and in the name of the Holy Ghost, in the name of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I'm not going to go into full detail about this story of Lazarus. But I know most of you, you are familiar to this story. you. Amen. You shall see a testimony. Yes, Lord. You shall testify. I will testify. In the name of Jesus, we pray. And, and 
Jesus lifted up his eyes and said, Father, I thank you that you have heard me. And I know that you always hear me. But because of the people who are standing by, I said this, that they may believe that you sent me. 43. Now when he said these things, he, crow, he cried with a loud voice, Lazarus, come forth. And he who died came out bound hand and foot with grave clothes. And his face was wrapped with a cloth. Jesus said to them, Loose him and let him go. Now Jesus believed. He gave glory to God. He thanked the Lord. He said, God, I thank you because you have heard me. And take this into consideration. He said, I thank you because you have heard me. And that was even before he told Lazarus to arise. What am I saying to you? First thing first, you need to believe. Number two, give glory to God and say, God, I thank you. Praise and worship him. And tell him that, God, I thank you because you have heard me. Hey. Just even before you even uttered hey. to the issue. Yes. Before you tell the situation, your situation change. Yes. You say, God, I thank you because you have heard me. Yes, Lord. Number three. After thanking God, he spoke to the problem. The problem was Lazarus, the dead body. He said, Lazarus, come forth. Lazarus, come forth. I don't know what is it that is dead in you, but Lazarus, come, come forth. Yes, Lord. Whatever that is dead in you, Lazarus, come, come forth. Yes, yes. If it is marriage, let it come back to life. Yes, yes. If it is success, yes. let it come back to life. Yes. If it is career, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is a relationship, yes. let it come back to life. Come if forth. it is finances, yes. let it come back to life. If it is your love, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is your joy, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is your peace, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is your patience, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is your kindness, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it's your faithfulness, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is the gentleness, yes. let it come back to life. Come if it is self-control, yes. let it come back to life. Come my father, my father, my father, my father, I declare, yes, Lord. and I decree, yes, Lord. Whatsoever, whatsoever that was dead, that was dead. in my life, let it resurrect Let it resurrect by the power, by the power that rose oh, Jesus Christ yes, Lord. from the grave. Yes. I declare yes. and I decree oh, my God. with the same power. Yes, Lord. Resurrection, Resurrection is possible. Is Resurrect now, resurrect now, resurrect now. My relationship, resurrect, resurrect. my breakthrough, resurrect. resurrect. Yes, Lord. Shabrekato. Yes, Jesus. In the betos. Resurrection. Lakato brekoto. Resurrection. Rakata bete. Resurrection. In the menike. Resurrection. Kapatala baya. Resurrection. Yes, Lord. Resurrection. In the name of Jesus. Yes. We pray. Yes, Lord. We are moving. 
We are moving. Libra Scatalaba. Hallelujah there. Amen. Wherever you are, hallelujah. Amen. And he who had died came out bound hand and foot with grave clothes. And his face was wrapped with a cloth. Jesus said to them, loose him and let him go. We were praying for resurrection. That whatever that was dead in your life, may it resurrect in the name of Jesus. Amen. Resurrection, it is possible. Amen. Resurrection, it is possible. But your things, the dead body can resurrect, but be still bound. You can get a job that you prayed for, for such a long time. job has resurrected but the money is bound. You can earn a lot of money but no peace in your workplace because it is bound. Your fortune, your fortune might resurrect but be still bound. You can rise on your feet and walk and people would see you everywhere in the streets going around and thinking that you are healthy but only to find you are like a dead man who is walking because your health it is bound but though you are still living you are walking and in our eyes we see such a healthy person somebody who is you know what who is healthy who is fit but you are bound your peace can resurrect upon your life it is possible we are going to lose the word of God says in the book of Matthew Whatsoever you bind on earth, it shall be bound in heaven. And whatever you lose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. I want us to go and lose everything. We lose everything that is resurrected upon your life. Because of even though resurrection is possible in Christ, there are chances that you might not enjoy even after the resurrection. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. As I pray. As I pray. As I decree. As I decree. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I lose. I lose. I lose. I lose. I lose. I lose. All the grips. All the grips. Of the devil. Of the devil. I lose. I lose all the grips, all the grips of the enemy all the upon my life. Upon my life, I lose, I lose everything, everything that was bound, that was bound in, my life. in my life. In the name of Jesus, name of Jesus. begin to pray and lose. I lose, I lose. Rabakatos, Kapataniabaya, Ribatos, Kapatos, Kalibaya, Rimantolos, Katonio. I lose my job from the grave. I lose my health from the grave. I lose my peace from the grave. I lose, I lose, I lose. I lose my marriage from the grave. I lose my relationship from the grave. Wherever you are, I pray for you. May the Lord contend against your contenders. May the Lord put shame upon those who want to put shame against you. May the Lord scatter all their evil plans upon you. May the Lord stand on your behalf and scatter their meetings. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May his face shine upon you. When you go in, you 
you shall be blessed. When you go out, you shall be blessed. You are the light yes. of the top of the hill. Yes. You are the salt. The salt. You shall not lose flavor. Not lose you are the glory of God. Yes, Lord. There is God yes. who is living in you. Yes, yes. There is God yes. who is upon your life. Yes. There is God watching you. There is God who is protecting you. Begin to pray and thank the Lord for what he has done for you, for what he is doing now, for what he is about to do. I stand under this apostolic grace of my father. Wherever you are watching us, wherever you are joining us from, whether from Teams or YouTube, listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. You are about to experience a new season. You are about to experience a new season. The new has come. Oh, the new has come for somebody in this house today. The bad news is that we do not run out of prayer points. We run out of time. Listen to me. Distance is not a hindrance. My father says that God trusts the material that he made you out of. Whatever you are going through right now, whatever you are going through right now, as it happened to Lazarus, resurrection is possible. Resurrection is about to hit you wherever you are. That career might seem dead. Looking for job might seem nothing is working, but listen to me, resurrection is possible. Oh my God. And very soon we'll be arriving on Pentecost. Believe you me, something will be happening. My God, my God. My God, my God. Though the root thereof works old in the earth, and the stock therefore die in the ground, yet through the scent of water, just by a touch, you don't need much, you need a touch. You need a touch. And wherever you are, God has touched you. Can we celebrate Jesus wherever you are? Clap your hands and celebrate Jesus. Oh my God. You are singing. of your life. Jubilation is your name. Celebration is your name. Oh my God. Oh my God. Thank you, Jesus. Distance is not a hindrance. The same atmosphere that is in this house is right there where you are. Amen and amen. 
Can I hear your digital hand? Can I see your digital hands there? Wow, wow, what a moment. What a moment of prayer it was. You know, God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that which we can think or imagine. Listen to me. God is doing something. Amen. You know, here at YIA, Youth in Action, when we have speakers, we do not just leave them, but we pray for them. To say, oh God, give them strength. Increase them in their revelation. Increase them in their strength. In whatever they are doing, oh God, let it be great. So wherever you are, I want you to pray right now for the son of our father, Commissioner Amusa Jones. Just begin to pray wherever you are. Just pray for him. Just pray for him. Father, right now we come before your presence. Father, we stand as young people and we pray for Commissioner Jones. We say, oh God, we say, oh God, oh God, oh God, increase him. Increase him. Let the fire burn that he is unable to contain it. Let the fire burn that it shall burst forth upon those around him, close to him, where he works, where he moves, where he goes, everything he touches. Father, let it be turned into gold. In the name of Jesus, I stand right now under the apostolic grace of my father and the pastoral grace of my mother. I say right now, in the name of Jesus, he is blessed. He is blessed. He is blessed. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, we thank this God for what he has done and, and what he's doing through this online prayer. Listen, testimonies are coming in. God is doing things. Lives are being transformed. Lives are being changed just by this prayer. Some people could not pray for 30 minutes, but because of this, they are now able to go for an hour. If you notice, you have just even exceeded an hour right now. Why? Because there is power in corporate prayer. So thank you for joining us this day. Thank you for joining us tonight. It was indeed a wonderful thing. I just have some few announcements. Tomorrow on Saturday, the 13th, we will be distributing flyers here. As you saw in our group, our father posted it, 12 o'clock, midday. So please be here, be here, be here, be here. Understand this, after Lazarus resurrected and he was taken out, you know what Lazarus did? Lazarus went out and preached what happened to him. So it's time for you to go forth, go forth. So tomorrow come as we distribute flyers. As you know, our conference, our main conference, Hope Restoration Conference is coming. Can I hear your digital hands? So tomorrow we'll be distributing flyers and putting poster around here, around here, Soweto. We want this conference to make noise. And it's you who is able to do that. Hallelujah. So to you all, see you on Sunday here at HQ, Flag Fontaine or at Freedom Park, or Western Cape or Venda. Just choose any branch. We are available. Thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us. May God bless you. May God keep you. And may God increase you. Stay blessed.